2018, German watchmaking company Glashute Original released two divers named the CQ and the CQ Panorama, based on the watch brand's first diver made back in 1969. Today, we are going to cover the CQ Panorama and answer the question, is this the best dive watch ever made? The dial. Let's start off with the stunning blue sunray dial, which appears to be an Oxford blue, but we'll just call it blue to make it a little easier. On this dial, you'll find the date window sitting somewhere between the four and five hour markers. Unfettered and unclouded by the standard date window placements you'll find typically on other divers. This is also called the panorama date. With a 43.20 millimeter case diameter, as well as a 15.65 millimeter case height, this watch is a little large, but it's not overly bulky. I'm going to go ahead and turn off the lights and grab a great shot of the looms on this watch. Immediately you'll notice it's very bright and features a pale blue color. So rest assured, in any low light scenario you may find yourself in, you will still be able to see the hands and hour markers very clearly. Case back and movement. Displayed behind an open sapphire crystal case back, you'll find Glashute's Caliber 3613, an awesome movement with 41 joules and a power reserve of 100 hours. This is a 28 hour difference between similar divers in the CQ's league. Here, you have a wonderful shot of the skeletonized rotor that does feature a 21 karat gold oscillating mass. The watch does have a water resistance of 1,000 feet or 30 meters. Case profile. Immediately you'll notice the great detail and branding on the crown's head, as well as large grooves for easy setting of the watch's time and date feature. With an excellently brushed case, this pairs well with some polished features here, noted on the corners of the lugs, which brings a drastic edge to the case's shape. The bracelet. You have an impeccably brushed bracelet clearly displayed to the naked eye. Although, under a macro lens, you can fully appreciate the painstaking detail in all its glory. On the wrist. The watch looks great, but feels great too. For its size, you would expect a much heavier watch, but this does come in a tad lighter than anticipated, with great mobility all around. Not to mention, due to its larger presence, there's a much bigger impact on the wrist, certain to stand out among some of its competitors. So, to answer the question, is the Glass Shooter CQ Panorama the best diver? I mean, that is relative, because there's so many fine divers out there. But to summarize it in three short words, it is brilliant. A modern recreation of the brand's first diver back in 1969, the watch has big shoes to fill, faithfully reproducing this watch and surprising many, myself included, by its ability to win you over by the smallest of nuances. It is a watch for those who get lost in the details. It was truly a pleasure getting to work with this watch, but being on the more expensive side, priced at $12,400, it is entirely worth it. This watch is available today, so please give us a call at 239-227-2932. Thank you all so much for watching. If you appreciate this video, please like and subscribe. Go ahead and tell us in the comments what other watches you'd like to see us review, underrated or not. Thank you so much. Everybody have a great day.